Once you grasp this truth that I'm about to tell you, it'll set you free from religion, it'll set you free from parents and moms and family and governments and police, everybody, it'll set you free. And it's simply this, you are divine. God has exploded in a crab nebulae explosion and he has come and manifested himself as billions of people. And you're one of you, and so am I. When I look at you, I see God. When you look at me, you see God. That's why God's name is I Am. I Am God. It doesn't mean that me, God, it means I Am. When you say I Am God, you have to say what is God's name? I Am. What? I Am God. Oh my God, then all the people, Christians run around. Oh, I told you they think they're God. I don't think anything on the side. No, Jesus Christ said. The scripture says you are God, and the scripture cannot be broken. So he said it. Yeah, yeah, I'm like a third album. Peace, 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 family. How you all doing? My name is Keisha. I'm the owner of Ascendant Astrology, and I am your astrology coach. Today, I'm going to be discussing uh, Saturn and Aquarius, continuing my Saturn Through the Sign series. So what is Saturn? Saturn is very heavy energy, limitations, restrictions, responsibility, and hard work. Saturn shows you what type of challenges you're most likely to face throughout your entire lifetime. It also gives you information on how to deal with obstacles. Saturn rules limitations, organization, structure. It is your reality. It's very practical. It rules fear, anxiety, loneliness, discomfort, boundaries, discipline, and can be a workaholic. Aquarius lives in the 11th house. This rules uh, your social groups, social networks, on and offline. Um, it's humanitarian work. And so this can, um, this uh, placement can feel like uh, friendships are a lot of work. Uh, maintaining friendships can be a lot of work. Um, it could also bring isolation and challenges and fitting in a group. Um, these people tend to keep their social circles very small. They want quality, dependable, long-lasting, stable friendships. You don't want people who are not going to be there for you, who's not going to um, be there 20 years from now. Um, you want someone who takes friendship very seriously because you do. You are reliable. You show up for people and expect the same thing. Uh, these can be people who tend to gain friends through their work environment uh, or a work network um, or just connecting with others in general, really in any uh, failed place or uh, population. Um, these people can also become leaders in these fields in the workplace. So say if you work at like a big corporation that has a group, you'd somehow be um, either structuring that group or you actually start that group and maintain that group. Um, um, your friends can either be older or younger than you. Um, Mm, these people are great leaders. Um, they can be in any kind of um, finance, stockbroker, uh, uh, organizing large groups and events, scientific fields, robotics, and gain through other people. So this is my interpretation of Saturn and Aquarius. As usual, family, I love and appreciate you. I hope you found this information helpful. Peace.